at my pack a little over a week ago. These snow banks were about six or seven feet tall. But we had two days of 50 and pouring rain. Yesterday was 50 and pouring rain. And it has all but got rid of it. Ground's a little stiff, not too bad. Found a couple spots that were diggable. A couple might not be. But uh, down where that standing water is, I guarantee you that's all frozen two inches under it. It's kind of why I picked this place. It's on a hill, so the cold water doesn't sit on it. 50 degree air gets to it, maybe it'd be thawed. But as long as I dig one successful hole today, I will be a happy camper. <laughs> my season's probably going to be over after this so what happens today is going to be it but playing with a new phone too first video done with it we'll see how it comes out but uh, let's get to digging been looking forward to this for a while let you know if I find anything good alright first target Holy crap, the wind's well. Wow. Whoa. Pull dab. And beaver tail. From the mud. And the bottom of the hole is starting to fill in with water. It's gonna be one of them days. Just like it was in the spring. A lot of deep rusty iron's gonna ring up good. Oh well. I dug something on the 15th of uh, December. <laughs> Gotta love it. Well, from way down there came this thing. I think it's silver from the black tarnish that's on it. But it is all sorts of mangled. Maybe the end of a spoon handle or something? I don't know. When I get home, I'll clean it up and try to unfold it. It's heavy. Rang up a 2122. Interesting. Oh well, back at Dagon. Well, from right there, I just took that silver thing right there. From right there, I thought I had gold. I don't think it's anything too special, just some sort of a snap. But I saw the edge of it and had me going for a second. <laughs> no well. What can you do? Digging targets, middle of December. <laughs> Chunks of ice floating down the river. But, anyway, back at it. All right, from down there came this thing. I have no idea. Looks like a reed of some kind, maybe. Oh, sounded good. Interesting. I don't know. I think it's broken. But huh? Mystery pots. Nope. Here comes the wind. Back at it. All right, wind's blowing. Don't know if you can hear me or not. I have no idea how well this thing records. Um, I think I just dug a big copper. Like right on top of a root. And I scooped out a whole bunch of stuff on the left and flipped it over and it's sitting right there. Still in clump. I think it's a big copper. It's heavy. Oh, it's a gorgeous copper. Oh, let me get this cleaned up a little bit and I'll get right back to you. Oh, the hell of a way to end the season right there. Wow. Alright, I'll get back to you in just a second. 
definitely what it is. Eighteen forty-seven. How cool is that? Really good shape. That's awesome. I'll back at it. See what else I can squeak out of here. I wasn't expecting that, but I'll take it. Sweet. All right, I just dug that copper right there. Right here. I got a high tone. And a thin coin. An Indian. Oop, lost it. Put phone down, I'll clean up and get back to you. All right, from right there. I get an 1847 Largy from right here. I get a memorial. Huh. That's the part for you. It's a lot prettier when it's green. Dead is not a good color. <laughs> These things all look dead. But, oh, having a great time. Gonna love it. Back at it. Well, I'm back at the truck. Now I'm all done for the day. Friggin' wind. When it picks up, it's friggin' cold. You can see some ice on the bank over there. Water come up a lot. We got a couple inches of rain yesterday. But good to be back at my park. Sucks to think I might not be here for another four months, but I do have a feeling today might be the last day. It's supposed to cool down, get snow on Tuesday, be teens and single digits and stuff all in the evenings. So, and they're saying there could be a storm right before Christmas, so. Got a feeling this might be the last time I see this place in a few months. If that's the case. The last coin I dug was that one. A freaking gorgeous large scent. Absolutely gorgeous. Great details. Full liberty. That is just fantastic. It's all dried up now. I don't even think I'm going to clean the mud out of it when I get home. I think the mud's what makes the details stick out. That's just fantastic. That's a great way to end the year. You gotta love it. But anyway, if this is the last vid for the year, I'll have to say Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. I'll see you about Memorial Day. <laughs> nah, probably not that late. Mid to, mid to late April. Fingers crossed. It'll probably snow till July now. But, any which way, great to get out. At least I got to get one more vid in, so. Till the next adventure, whenever that might be, 2020.